This is Indosonic 1R2, the base model ultrasound offered by HMS Medical Systems. So now out of the factory, this Indosonic will come with a transducer and a gel and a power cable and a user manual. So you can have the user manual to clear all your doubts. Switching on the machine is very simple. You just have to plug in the power cable to the back of the machine and there will be a power button to the back. You just have to switch it on. It's very simple and now the machine is now on. So now we'll go through the different knobs and uh, keys functions. So the first knob over here is used to select the different modes which are available with this machine. Basically, this machine operates in 1 MHz frequency and there are 5 different modes with it. The first one is the continuous mode and the fourth, second one is 1 is to 9, third one is 2 is to 8, fourth one is to 2 is to 3 and the fifth one is 1 is to 1. So these are the 5 different modes which are available with Indosonic 102. And next, these two buttons are used to set the timers. So the, we can set a maximum of 99 minutes. This one is the start to pass button. So after setting the timer, you just, you just have to press the start button in order to start the treatment. The knob over here is the intensity knob, which is used to vary the intensity level of the transducer. So the maximum intensity level is 3 watts. So now uh, we'll get to uh, unique features which this machine has and none of its competition has those features. First, we'll start off with the transducer. This transducer is waterproof one, so you can give the underwater treatment to small areas like feet, your fingers and ankles, etc. So this is the most unique feature which the ultrasound has. And another feature is the auto sensing feature. So this machine, whenever there is no contact with the skin, the transducer is gets off and uh, there is no supply from the transistors to, to the skin. Whenever the transducer comes in contact back to the skin, the treatment gets resumed and the timer starts to go on. So this is one of the unique feature and there are several advantages because of this auto sensing feature and we'll go through that now. First, with the auto sensing feature available, the transistor when not placed on the skin will get heated up when on when not placing on the skin. So this auto sensing feature prevents the heating of the transducer and it increases the lifetime of the transducer. Second is that whenever the transducer is in the air without in contact with the skin, the transducer gets overheated. So after getting overheated, when you place it on a patient's skin, this may hurt the patient. So that one is also prevented. Third unique feature with the transducer, whenever the transducer is not in contact with the skin, the timer gets stopped. More effectiveness with the treatment timing because the treatment time gets stopped whenever the transducer is not placed on the skin. So this will not count down the times whenever the transducer is in the air. So which will give, create more effectiveness in the treatment time. So these are the advantages of the auto sensing feature which are available with the ultrasound. So the another advantage feature with the auto sensing feature is that whenever there is no enough gel when giving the treatment, the transistor, transducer gets cut off. So this is a very advantageous feature when giving a treatment. And next, we also have error codes which will indicate the type of problem the machine undergoes. So it can be an internal component error or for example, I have set the timer and I am starting the machine. Now it shows error E2 code which means that the transducer is not connected. So there are several types of error codes available with this machine which indicates several problems. All those error codes are for your easy identification of the problem of the machine so that you can report it to the service center and get repaired very easily. So the error codes information are given in the manual and you can check it out there. This is one example for the error code depiction. I am inserting the transistor back to the machine, back into the machine. Now the error code goes away. So after uh, plugging in the transistor, the error code goes off and we are now giving the treatment. So now uh, we will uh, give you a, a small glimpse about the auto sensing feature.
Now the transducer is taken away from the skin surface. Now the transducer turns red color here over here and uh, the machine starts beeping stating that the transducer is not in contact with the skin so it starts intimating you about the contact issue. Now the timer also will stop right there whenever the transducer is not in contact with the skin. As soon as the transducer, transducer gets in contact with the skin, the timer goes on now and now the treatment gets started. So this is very effective while giving a treatment because whenever the transducer is not in contact with the skin, the timer should not go away. So this will create an ineffective treatment time. So this feature is very handy while giving any type of treatment. Yes, so whenever the transducer gets to a dry area where there is no enough gel, the skin contact, as you can see, the light is blinking here and there, which means that yes. the transducer is not detecting the skin and it stops the treatment here and there. So this is also a very useful feature with the auto sensing one. And now I'll show you how to disable the auto sensing feature. So before starting of the treatment, before starting of the treatment, this button over here can be used to switch off the auto sensing feature. So now I'm pressing this sensor button over here and now it's in off state. The auto sensing feature is now in off state. Now we'll, after starting of the machine even though there is no contact with the skin the transducer is in green color light which means that the treatment is going on now so this time the auto sensing feature is in off state so we give this level of customization to the therapist while giving the treatment they can either have auto sensing feature or they can disable it according to their needs since this transducer is a waterproof you can also give underwater treatments to small areas like uh, fingers, foot and uh, ankles, wrists. So those areas can be treated by uh, submerged under the water. So this transducer can be submerged under the water and given treatment to those areas. This trans transducer over here is a 5 cm square transducer which comes standard with the equipment itself. And you can also buy a 1 cm square transducer if you want from the company for additional cost. So that's it for all. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. And this is all about the demonstration of Indosonic 102. I hope this was helpful. And thanks for purchasing a product from HMS. And we hope we serve our best to you.